Well, both Sled and Walterboro police are investigating a deadly shooting that killed a young father of two. 24 year old Stefan Young died Saturday night. Witnesses say Young was shot outside a mobile home park around some children who were playing in that area. Tonight, the victim's mother talks to ABC News 4's Nikki Gaskins. Witnesses on Francis Street here in Walterboro say the victim, 24 year old Stefan Young, was shot in front of this mobile home, the Pine Brook community. Today, these flowers serve as a sad reminder of yet a second life lost in a matter of four days. He was gunned down to violence for no reason. Confused and angry, Sharice Green is a mother in mourning, leaving behind these flowers with her family in the very spot her son lost his life. He was the only son I had. And regardless to his flaws or his wrongs or his rights, he was still my child. And nobody had no right to do the stuff they did to him. Just a few days before her own son's death, a mother of three also died from gunfire in Walterboro. Deputies have since blamed gangs fighting over territory. And we out here grieving. Other people might think it's a joke, it's funny, this gang stuff is not real, but... It is. While Green says gangs are a problem in the area, she says what led to her son's own death isn't clear. We just got the call to come because he was shot. And when I got here, my daughter seen him take his last breath with his eyes open. I just still can imagine somebody would want to gun him down in the middle of the street like he was a stray dog. Dominique Singleton knew Young and was returning home with her children when she saw him lying on the ground. My heart was just into my stomach because I couldn't believe what I was actually witnessing. Neighbors say they heard about 10 gunshots the day Young was shot. You saw the children outside playing. You saw the people walking up and down the road. It was a beautiful Saturday afternoon. As she prepares to bury her only son, Green says neighbors and police need to work together, making the community they call home safer. We need to stick together and pull together. It's not going to take one person. It's not going to take two person. It's going to take army. According to Stefan's mom, her son would have turned 25 in July. Reporting in Walterboro, Nikki Gaskins, ABC News 4.